question about the safety of women is the background against which a new play is being staged in Winchester. An all-female cast tells the story of the notorious murder of a young woman in the 19th century. Bryony Leyland reports. When they find my body and they see what he did to me, Giving voice to a woman whose story has never been told from her perspective. Mariah Martin was murdered in 1827. Her body was hidden in a barn by her lover, William Corder, who tricked her into thinking they were about to elope. The gruesome details of her death became a favourite melodrama on the Victorian stage. But now a Hampshire writer has brought Mariah's life into focus. It's often been told as this sort of almost like a romp, like an a, a adventure as to what's going to happen. I'm dreaming of what we wanted to do was to look at it from what it must be like to be the partner of a man who was what we would now describe as controlling. You bring me down to earth. You bring me down to earth. Along with historical research, Beth worked with women in a refuge who'd experienced coercive control. They helped me with the story. They kind of went through it and went, this, this is probably what he'd said to her. This is why she'd change her hair. This is why she's changing her clothes. You said that I had no this is why she's getting confused. He stole from her. He did a lot of things. Only you, only you, only you. And they would explain that for me. William Corder, who escaped to the Isle of Wight from Suffolk, was eventually tried and hanged for Mariah's murder. The play doesn't show violence on stage, and much of the story celebrates the strength of women supporting each other. But the all-female cast feel very strongly the power of exploring violence against women at a time when it's so much in the news. It feels like a very topical piece, despite being set in 1820. Very sadly, you know, we're still having these same discussions and the same things are happening. The last few weeks in the wake of Sarah Everard and Sabina Nessa, it feels very, Important. very here and present, doesn't mm. it? And you have a line about that, actually. She had, she had a life yeah. and she should have lived it. And every time I say it, I'm like, oh, gosh, it gets me a little bit more. She had a life and she should have lived it. The play opened at Winchester's Theatre Royal tonight and goes to Basingstoke next, bringing history to life and contributing to a conversation about the here and now. Bryony Leyland, BBC South Today, Winchester. Finally, there's been a boost. That